How to fix engine coolant temperature light. If you see a coolant temperature warning light on your dashboard in red, blue, yellow, or green, it's important to address the issue promptly to avoid potential engine damage. Here's a guide on what to do for each color. Blue light, meaning the engine is cold. Action. This is usually not a problem. Just allow the engine to warm up before driving aggressively. No immediate action is needed. Green light, meaning indicates the engine temperature is within the optimal range, though green is rare for temperature indicators. Action. No action needed as this is normal operating temperature. Yellow, amber light, meaning the engine is starting to get too warm. Action. Check coolant level. Ensure the coolant level is adequate. Top it off if necessary. Inspect for leaks. Look for any coolant leaks under the car or around the engine bay. Monitor temperature. Keep an eye on the temperature gauge and avoid heavy engine load. Red light. Pull over safely. If you see the red coolant light illuminated on the dashboard, pull over to a safe location as soon as it's safe to do so. Continuing to drive with an overheating engine can cause severe damage. Turn off the engine. Once safely stopped, turn off the engine immediately. Allowing the engine to cool down is essential to prevent further damage. Wait for the engine to cool. Give the engine sufficient time to cool down. This can take anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour depending on the severity of the overheating. Check coolant level. After the engine has cooled down, open the hood and locate the coolant reservoir. Check the coolant level and ensure it's between the min and max marks on the reservoir. If the coolant level is low, add the appropriate type of coolant. Check radiator and cooling system components. Inspect the radiator, radiator cap, hoses, and water pump for any signs of damage or leaks. Replace any components that appear worn or damaged. Verify thermostat operation. Test the thermostat to ensure it's opening and closing correctly. A faulty thermostat can cause overheating issues. Check cooling fans. Ensure the cooling fans are operating properly. If they're not functioning, it can lead to inadequate airflow through the radiator, contributing to overheating. Refill coolant if necessary. If the coolant level was low, refill the reservoir with the appropriate type of coolant. Follow the manufacturer's recommendations for the correct coolant type and mixture ratio. Restart the engine. Once you've addressed any coolant leaks and verified the coolant level, restart the engine and monitor the temperature gauge closely. Seek professional help if necessary. If the red coolant light persists or if you're unable to identify and fix the issue yourself, it's advisable to seek assistance from a qualified mechanic. They can perform a thorough inspection of the cooling system and diagnose any underlying problems. Preventive maintenance. Schedule regular maintenance for your vehicle's cooling system, including coolant flushes and inspections, to prevent future overheating issues. Addressing a red coolant light promptly and effectively can help prevent serious engine damage and ensure the continued safe operation of your vehicle. Thanks for watching, and subscribe for more. If you find this video useful, please like and share it with your friends, and if you have any questions, leave a comment we'll respond.